bring the heat back at you with a little bit of a different product review today. Uh, we were fortunate enough to have Jimmy Pickles, old Jim Morrow from JP Pepper Seeds, be able to send us some of his pepper powders, give a review and see how we like them and talk about his seeds a little bit. So he sent us several of them. The one we're going to start off with today is the Lemon Ghostly Jalapeno. see it there. Get you over there and see that picture of that pepper there. Um, just from a little bit of info from his website, um, the original ghostly jalapeno was a ghost cross with a jalapeno, which you know, it makes sense from, from the name of it. It was originally created by a man named Jack Skaggs from Ohio. It was originally a long, bumpy type of pepper. It had a quick burn that lingered around a little bit. Um, Jimmy Pickles went on a quest for trying to find different color variants of this of this pepper and in that quest he sold a few seeds to one of his customers and he got the yellow color variant. Um, so let's get a little bit out here and yeah, talking about Jimmy Pickles seeds he does not sell the powder so don't go looking on his website for this particular powder here after seeing a review but he sells seeds. He sells isolated seeds. You know, some of you may be thinking, what that, what does isolated seeds mean to me? It means you're going to get the seed that you want, that you're looking to buy on his website. You know, you, there's a guarantee you're getting that seed, the one you click on, the one you pay for. You know, if you follow his YouTube, his YouTube channel at all, he has a few garden tours on there, so you can kind of see what his isolation process is. He takes the certain types of peppers and grows them almost together and then takes mosquito netting and covers them completely to where they're isolated from any kind of pollination and cross-pollination from any of the plants around them. And that's how he's able to guarantee you that you're getting what you're paying for and you're not going to get some seed in the mail. You're going to plant it and it pops up and be in some kind of cross or something other than what you initially wanted. Let's see here. Let's see if I can get this bag open and get a little powder on a spoon and give her a try. A nice smell to it. See if I can get these powdered up to you here. Get you a fair look at it. It's a very light colored powder. Of course, the you know it's a yellow pepper type itself, so you're gonna get the light colors and the flakes. Hmm. It's got good flavor. Got some citrus notes in there, a little sweetness, but it's got a heat that just kind of punches you right up front. Um, I think you can consider this a mid super hot, just because you know it has that cross with with the ghost in it, so it fits in that super hot category on the middle end there. Got a nice little heat. Nothing too much, nothing that's gonna burn you you too bad. I don't know if you know the pod would be any different on a fresh pod, seeing that you have the capsaicin oils and stuff going on, on the inside. I've never had a fresh pod of this particular pepper, but you know, like his website says, it does come on very strong, but then it it dissipates fairly quickly, which is good for good for some people that want that initial flavor heat. But don't want their mouth to be burning on for, for too long. Um, in every order of Jimmy Seeds, you're going to get 10 seeds in your pack. And then you typically he throws in a few free seeds in your order, some stickers and some other odds and ends stuff. So if you need you some good isolated seeds, this here is a tasty powder. Some peppers are probably going to be tasty as well. If you want something that's not going to burn your face off but has a little bit of heat and good flavor, check out this lemon ghostly jalapeno. It's going to be a good option and when I start my garden next year I believe this will be something that I look at throwing in my garden as well. If you like what you're watching make sure you like, subscribe, comment. Until then we'll see you later.
jppepperseeds.com. Jimmy Pickles. You also check him out on YouTube. Don't block this up there. <laughs>